I wanna talk about me, wanna talk about I, wanna talk about number one on my Hello again guys, it's Janice at paulsdreamandjoy.blogspot.com and wow, I got a lot of emails and responses and comments on my blog, on Facebook, on YouTube and just straight through email about the Mini Me book. So I've decided that I'm going to try to provide a question once a week. We'll start today. I'll do the second one next Tuesday and just to brain, help you brainstorm and journal about yourself. Like I had said before, us crafters tend to do a lot of scrapbooking and crafting for our family and friends and we tend to leave ourselves out of it. So this is a way to make a little mini project for you that others can enjoy and will also give you some me time. So the first question for today is, if you could slow down any part of your day, which part would it be? and you can make your mini book any way you like. You can include pictures or not, it's completely up to you. Mine will probably not have pictures. I like to do a lot of writing and journaling, so I'm sure I'll fill it up with that. You can also make your mini book in any form you like. I'm gonna use the form that I like the most, which is taking the A2 size envelope and sealing it, cutting along one edge, you know, about right here, and when I get a circle punch, because my other one has broken, I'll put a little circle half a circle cut right there so I can pull the tag out what I normally do is put the question on the outside and then I'll put the answer on the inside I'm going to use binding rings to keep mine together but some other options that you may enjoy are tags uh, you can keep your tags together with the binding ring or with the ribbon or any any kind of way that you want to make a mini book is fine it doesn't matter the whole point of it is to have some me time and to make something about yourself So this is the first question for today. On the other side, I have just put 52Q week one, 2010. So we'll see if we actually get to 52 weeks. We'll see how well that goes. I am putting the link at the bottom. If you will click on the blue button and post your page for today, and then each week we'll have another link and you can post your page for the next day because we all want to see what everybody else is doing. That always um, gives us lots, of, lots more ideas. So this is my outside. And then on the inside, I put a little bit larger turtle. And I didn't put the shell on the, on the top of this so I could write on this. So that's where I'm going to put my answer. And then I'm going to slip him right back inside of here. I used the Give a Hoot for the sunshine and the grass. And I used Creative Critter for the turtle. My turtle is cut at, let me see, two and a half inches. And the sun is cut at, the yellow sun is cut at three inches, the orange sun is cut at two and a half. And the grass on the bottom is actually the grass that had the tulips on it. I just snipped those off and I cut that at, at one inch. And I'll put all the details on my blog. So this is page one for me. And I hope you guys will participate and do page one and post a link so we can all come check it out. And I'll see you again next week with the 52Q. Have a great day. Bye. See, I like talking about you, 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 usually, but occasionally, I want to talk about me.